Hey guys, so in this video, I'm going to be talking about the best VPNs that you can use if you're going to be visiting China. And the reason why you want a VPN is because of something called the Great Firewall of China. And that's the name for a bunch of different things, a bunch of different policies and actions that the Chinese government has taken in order to censor and restrict which websites and services you can use on the internet. So for example, ChatGPT itself right here is blocked in China, as well as YouTube, Facebook, and a bunch of other different, very popular websites. But if you have the right VPN, which is a piece of software that'll look something like this, this is called ExpressVPN, then you can easily get around the Great Firewall and be able to access the free and open internet. Now, this VPN right here, ExpressVPN, is my personal favorite and is the one that I recommend to people when they're going to China. This is the one that tends to work really well and it's really simple and easy to use. All you have to do is go to the location bar right here and choose whichever country it is that you want to make it seem that you are from when you're using the internet. So even though you might physically be in China, if I would go here and I would choose the United States, for example, it'll say the United States right there and then I can just click connect. Now I'm going to connect up to a server in New Jersey and when I go to the internet now, it's going to think that I'm in the USA and I'll be able to access all the websites and services, everything as if you were physically in the US even though right now you just happen to be in China. And with ExpressVPN, you'll have access to 105 different countries. And if you don't wanna to connect to the United States, maybe you wanna make it seem as if you're in the UK or Turkey, it doesn't matter where, wherever it is, you'll have a lot of options, 105 with Express. One of the main reasons why I really recommend ExpressVPN, besides for the fact that it works in China and it works well, you'll get good speeds, you can access streaming content, all of that, besides for all of that, is going to be its privacy and security. ExpressVPN has a really good security policy and this has been audited by outside companies. So everything that you're doing with ExpressVPN is going to be secure and private. Nobody has access to it. Nobody, not the government, you're not your internet service provider, and not even ExpressVPN themselves are going to be able to see and know what you're doing online. So in a censorship heavy country like China, that is something that's really valuable. And I don't believe that there is a VPN that does it quite as well as Express does. Now, if you wanna try it out for yourself, I managed to get hold of a special discount, which you'll find in the description, that will save you some extra money on Express. And it also comes with a 30 day money back guarantee. So you can just test it out, see if you like it. And if you don't, then you can just ask for a refund and get your money back. And with any VPN, even if you don't wind up going with Express, it's always a good idea to make sure that you download it and install it on your computer before you go into China. Because once you're there, it gets a lot harder to actually download it and set it up. For example, I contacted ExpressVPN and I asked them, what does somebody do if they're in China and they're having trouble accessing the ExpressVPN website? And they gave me these two alternate links right here that you you can use i'll put these in the description down below and you can use those if you're actually in china and you're struggling to access the website these are two alternate links that you can use to access the website now express is not the only option when it comes to a vpn in china another one that you can check out is going to be surfshark this is a vpn that in my opinion doesn't have the same reputation for security and privacy it doesn't have that strong security for your information like ExpressVPN does. It also just isn't as easy to use, but it will work in China and it's a good option, especially if you're on a budget. It is cheaper than ExpressVPN, so if you're tight for cash, then you might wanna check this out. And here also, if you happen to be in China when you try to do this, the website to go to is going to be shark-china.com. Now, one last thing that's important to know here is that in China, there are a few different internet service providers, and the three main ones are going to be China Mobile, China Telecom, and China Unicom. And with the Great Firewall of China, things are always changing. So depending on which service provider you use, you may have more or less success with a certain VPN. Personally, in my testing, I had the most success with China Telecom, and among all three internet service providers, 
I had the best experience with ExpressVPN. It was just the most consistently able to get through the great firewall and access the websites that I wanted to access like Netflix and other streaming websites. But these things are changing all the time. It could be if something is going on in China or something's going on in the world, then they might crack down even more and make the restrictions tighter. So you may need to do some of your own research depending on what's going on and when you try to do this in order to get the most up to date and the latest information. For example, when I was doing research, I was not able to get NordVPN, a really good and popular VPN. I wasn't able to get it set up and working at all. It just wasn't able to get through the great firewall, but that couldn't change at any time. Things are always changing. So if you run into a problem, then you may need to try a different alternative, either a different VPN or a different internet service provider. But when there's a will, there is a way and eventually you will be able to access the free and open internet. So that's it for this video, guys. If you want to find out more about any of these VPNs, you'll find full in-depth reviews and those discount links in the description down below. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. Have an amazing day and I'll see you in the next one.